Right, so I'm switched over to headphones. Okay, we got volume. We got rhythm. We got rhyme. We have tired. Oh my god, am I tired? Oh, sweet cheese crackers, am I tired? Stupid rendering. I think I know why I'm so tired today. And it's not just because of the storm, although the storm isn't helping because man do I sleep amazing when it rains. So uh, twist it around. There we go. Push up. So, today has been a very trying day for me. There you go. Good job. <coughs> Excuse me. So, Last night, last night I did some recording, and then again I got through the recording fine, and that ended at like 9:30, and then it's like okay good, the recording the recording has ended, at, the recording has ended at 9:30, gives me plenty of time to wrap this up and go to bed. I forgot about the part about exporting the audio. 11.30 p.m. My audio finally exported. So, I am very understandably very wiped. But we push through. Straight. Push through. Bring the insides of your ankles up toward the ring con. That sad moment when you're not be mindful of your body. Balanced and stretch within the range of enough your ability. To lift your heel up. Last time. Yes. Just like that. Next is the back straightening stretch. Take a big step forward and drop your hips. Focus on lowering your body without putting too much weight on your front foot. Be sure to keep your lower back straight. Let's do one more of each. All right, good. Finally, spread your feet. Raise the ring con above your head and lean to the side. Oof. Focus on leaning to the side without bending forward. This should stretch both the muscles in your sides and in your arms. Let's do one more of each. Great job! Oh. Huh. You can just see thunderbolts and lightning outside. I 
don't have that combo. Okay. Okay, I think I'm remembering now. I went to the general store at the end of the last stream. Now, to warm my arms a little bit. Oh, I need cabbage. Ah, oh, more double ingredient stuff. Well, you know what this means. We need to make the last of our double ingredient stuff. Watch that whey protein thing also be double ingredients. You know, some raw defense buffs? I'll take it. Make. Are you ready? Squeeze. You know, raw cocoa? Pretty great. I mean, Unfortunately, you to put a little bit of milk in the cocoa, maybe a little sugar to make it so you don't die. But then again, that's what dark chocolate is. Okay. So let's make some basics here to get this all handled. Do a little bit of preparation for what comes next. As my arms cannot agree as to which way they want to turn. Man. This is the effects of being overly tired, by the way. Is your coordination is subpar best. Finished. I feel like this is not going to be a good night. <laughs> The same Please. stupid joke. Stupid joke. What? Stupid joke? The same stupid joke. Way to squeeze. Okay. So, Ashtapa. Okay, that's five heart recovery. Oh, I should make a bunch of these actually. Cancel some negative status effects. Most of these negative status effects things won't come into effect until, um, what is it? They will not come into effect until, until we start fighting bosses. Man. Looks tasty. There's like something catching right here in the middle of my chest. I've only had it happen once before in my life, but I feel like my sternum needs to pop. Okay. I feel like I got everything else on lockdown. So let's progress with the story finally. Ugh, sorry. Ugh, sorry. Oh 
okay? Ah. Well, the game is afoot. Pineapple, grapefruit, corn, ginger, spinach. You know what? We won't need to use the double up. At least not yet. Basically, when I see cabbage, is when we use the double up. Oh yeah, I'm I'm a, I'm, uh, I'm sand skeleton now. Okay, time to run. Well, I probably already missed the first token. jumped. There it is. Yay! Did we get hit? Yep. Doing good. <sighs> the skill. Yeah. I'm just all sorts of fantastic right now. Alright. Let's do a little bit of yoga. We'll see what the protein shaker has for us. And we'll go from there, eh? Let's see, get my feet positioned. Okay, switch, switch it up. Don't forget to switch legs. Actually, what I need to do is do like this, because it's the back foot of mine that always slips. Okay. With your legs bent slightly, squeeze. Hey, the after is actually working for once. Okay, so what stats are down? Red, green, blue. Well, that was actually exactly what I was planning going for next. Is some leg scissors. Alright, time for foot cam. Except, haha, no feet for you. What I am wearing socks! Thank <laughs> you. 
you know, this really is a bad bit that I keep oppressing too much with the whole no gamer feet, but it's my ring fit bit now. Oh, you do not want to know how amazing that felt to finally get that. This is fine. That belch had been sitting in there. I'm waiting to see plus fives in my attack and defense gains. By the way, I am over. I am over 500 in both stats right now. Ooh, fast enough. Stop. Dang it. Good thing the only thing I can lose is money during these old world segments. Which I have too much of. Two pose again. We don't take bait. Oh my gosh. I apologize, it's disgusting. But dude, you do not understand. Oh, wrong foot's forward. You don't understand how much I need that gas to be released. I feel so much better right now. Huh. 
Man, it's storming the command outside. No fear. No fear. Perfect cycle. Dang it. <laughs> too early but I feel like the ring fit session may be waking me up enough where I might want to do more of the ring fit today. Now turn your exercise into experience oh. points with a victory pose. Right. A little bit wider than normal. Charge your Squat. Power, but don't overextend your and drop it. Victory. Oh. Okay, we're warming up. Warming up. I have my choice of fight. Expedience or Gould? Well, I'll start with experience. So I'm going to play the minigame immediately afterwards. How many? Okay. Do I have banana? Do I have banana smoothie? Make sure I get two turns with this then. And we'll decide from there what I do, eh? So first thing first, again, okay. is like scissors. Like scissors. Because I love this exercise. Lots of works on the worst part of me. My bulbous gut. My gut not as bulbous as it was many years ago. Oh, no. It's my bulbous! Just round one. Also, my apologies if the stream goes down. It is raining with the son of a gun here. Thunderstorms and everything.
There we go. Now it's time. Okay, let's move. For the arm switch. This tonight will be a nice, Very simple nice. dinner Amazing. of salad. Sorry, my mind is just wandering tonight. Yes. Yes. Kind of lackadaisical. Awesome. been very hot the last few days and my brain is finally finally feeling the after effects of all the heat thankfully with all the rain coming through though it should it should be put more all that should be put more at a temper holy god that love that thunder was loud enough to shake the house oh uh, that's a problem Not gonna be enough to kill any of them, and they're probably all gonna run away. Yes. Knowing my luck. One left. Excellent. The enemy's disoriented. Now's our chance. Rush lift. Be sure to keep your upper back straight. Well, it's one. Who's running? None of them are running? Have I been given a gift? Or a curse? Oh, got those. That was amazing. Holy criminy, that was almost 4K experience. Nope. I don't have the balance for that. Let me look at it first. Nope. I don't have the balance to do the Warrior 3, unfortunately. A novice arrow shoot. Although it's foggy, so it's gonna be a problem, isn't it? There's some.
There we go, just drop it in. Try for it, right? Oh, I missed. Oh well. Do best, huh? New high score. What does that mean? Did I break it? Oh god, that's an old. That's a trying joke. And the loop is completed. What did I get for my trial? For my trial? Ginger. Oh. I uh, ginger. So, what things can I make with? Ah, heck. Well, I realized it too late, but I can make it now. We'll keep it stocked for the next rare Hoplin fight I do. Squeeze. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I just noticed things. That's probably the first thing somebody saw, read, or heard when they came in. As a, as a terrible, unruly belch. Oh, that's a follow. I didn't read the name. Let me actually read it. Kuretsu? Kuretsu? Is it Kuretsu or Kuretsu? Either way, thank you for the follow. Also, I am. Sorry, I'm checking notifications. That seems powerful, though. For, for whenever I feel like rushing someone down, whenever I need to rush someone down, I just pound down an almond, an almond, an orange, I, I, it's effectively an orange cream soda. This seems like effectively just drinking an orange cream soda. What's the name on it again? Orange all enough? No, it's an orange cream soda. Don't lie to me, fam. Okay. I got some of those. Big thing I'm missing right now. Hello. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, again, thank you very much for the follow. Ah, here it is. Ah, poop, I don't want it. Oh, none this. Double up on I have power. You got it. Yeah. But thank you very much for the follow. I started streaming this like almost as soon as I could because general Twitter Please. input was yeah I'd like to see Ring Fit and it's now become like uh, every time I play Ring Fit has now been streamed for the most part barring one or two times when my brain just wants to turn off for the night and not think Holy snap! Why is it so good? Let's squeeze. I should have I should have parsed my inventory. Squeeze. Looks tasty. Let's see. Well, I am very short on these, so let's get some backup banana. You know, actually, a banana smoothie sounds orgasmic right now. Squeeze. Wrong choice of words, but you know what? I'm going with it. Squeeze. 
So yeah, again, thank you for the follow. Uh, here's where I shame shamelessly shield for 30 seconds. I do stream more than Ring Fit, but this has become my trend. If you want to watch me do things that aren't stream Ring Fit, I've got links down below to everything else. Stream archive channel, main YouTube channel, stuff of that sort. You don't have to follow. I appreciate you following here on Twitch for the, at the very least. Poor word choice, but you know what I meant. <laughs> Thunderstorm outside. <laughs> Keep trying. You'll eventually get it. I mean, if it makes you feel any better, Kuretizu, uh, I'm going to have trouble saying that, so forgive me if I butcher it every now and again. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not exactly a sporty guy. Uh, genetics just make me naturally, at, make me naturally push through things. Uh, yeah. Like, naturally, I'll just push through stuff. Um, but yeah, if it makes you feel any better, about this time last year, and I, can't, I gotta stop saying that, because I really started, May 2019 is when I started on my quest. May last year, I was 360 pounds. I'm currently 250. At my best, I'm 240, but because of genetics again, no muscle mass, the the my ideal weight without looking like I'm a skeleton is about 230 so I will take 250 <laughs> so if your goal is just to get yourself some stamina get some stamina if your goal is to lose weight it is possible I am living proof of that Go through my list. Kuretis. Kuretis. Got it. I may still butcher it every now and again, but I got it. Kuretis. Kuretis. I know somebody who speaks Spanish. Why do. or Spanish? Japanese. I speak Spanish to a degree. Why do I not. man. I'm bad. Listen, I look gorgeous on the outside. That's how you fix the face you think otherwise, right? <laughs> uh, it also helps I'm wearing a vest underneath. Hey, man said nice ass. Game has nice ass but play. Holy cr Can we talk about that for a minute? <laughs> Can we talk about my word choice? <laughs> uh. Hi, yes, my name is Scooter. I'm a detriment to society. How are you today? <laughs> Alright, let's test out how much a double buff is. So, prepare for forehead cam while I do some Russian twists. obvious. I, uh, I say before I think sometimes. Especially on a night like tonight. It's 
I'm gonna say it wrong. Do know I made it in the best light. Max difficulty is 30. Oh, you mean the reps. Yeah. Oh, you think that's bad? Wait for this. Let me go. Let me go pop a smoothie because I want to make sure I get all the money from this. Uh, craisins? Uh, yeah, craisins. All right. I had a carbonated beverage for my second break, so I am very gassy right now. I apologize. So, just a fair warning, even though I'm playing at max difficulty, my body is still not fully fully prepared for it, so I will probably end up stopping mid-reps. But prepare for this. Um, World 15... Yeah, we're in world 15. There's more than there's more than 15 worlds from what somebody else has told me. Max difficulty, level 120 plus. There's your statistics to work with if you're kind of just wondering where I am. Okay, Game is go. RPG. It's Game is long. point now oh my arms are sore I think right now I'm at a point where anything happening now shouldn't spoil what happens where you where you are in the game it's that one point of an RPG if you've played many of them where there are things you know about in, in, in the first couple chapters that have zero relevance to the game in the latter half of it <laughs> You know, that story, that story thing that happens. And then it gets brought back randomly at the end of the game. So don't worry. I don't think you'll be spoiled on much of anything at this point. Good! I play RPGs, but I'm not very good at mid-maxing them. Okay! So I tend to play a lot of babies first RPGs, you know, the Mario and Luigi series, Golden Sun, although the eyeball of all that is Persona 4, the only Persona game I've played. Lightheaded. Eh. Nintendo guy, general gaming fan. I play games on PC as well, but I don't play. I play some shooters, but not a lot of competitive ones. So, kind of a mixed bag person. I think the only thing, the only thing, the only game type I don't play is real-time strategy or general strategy. Oh, it's torture, but I need to torture myself because 
I don't want to go back to what I was a year ago at 360 plus pounds. And I definitely don't want to go back to what I was five years ago, bordering 450 pounds. Oh God, the lights flickered. So I push myself because I don't want to be that anymore. And I try to use that as motivation for others. If me, if me, somebody who has been lazy for 30 plus years of their life can find the gall over the span of a year to do something professional bodybuilders might struggle with, then anybody else can. Got him. Got all four. Double money. I just got 4K money from that. Oh, squat rider. Thigh rider. All right. Welcome back to Share Camp, where I am Share. Or in a chair, rather. Yes, I was influenced by early YouTube. How could you tell? Yeah. Actually, I don't think you see... Uh, I don't think you've seen Thigh Rider yet. So, hey. You can learn about Thigh Rider. Although, this fog is an issue. And my reaction time is paltry at best. Well, instead of gaining 300 points, I lost 300 points. Again, I'll uh, vacate, but right now I'm okay. That's a bad mentality to have. I'm gonna look at my phone in just a second here to see what that emergency was. Did I? Oh, I got it fairly. Okay. It's a flash flood warning. I think I'm high enough where I don't need to worry about it, but that is a risk I knew was gonna happen this evening anyway. Oh, that was a nice rest. Ooh, set fire. Mm. One last thing I should like to know, Kuritsu. Um, Kuri Kuritsu? I'm gonna keep messing this up. I know I'm, try I'm trying to say Spanish, cur or Spanish, I'm trying to say Japanese Curtis, like you said, but I'm gonna keep bot botching it. <laughs> um, you guys, you can hear the game just fine. I can't. Because everything goes through my wireless headphones, and I'm not gonna wear these while I'm exercising. So everything I do in this game is all visual cues. Oh, I don't know any French whatsoever. And of course my friend who knows French is at work right now. Um, f 
Flash Flood, aka lots of water very fast. It's raining, it is very much raining. I apologize if that was demeaning in any way. I didn't mean for it to be. Just call it kind of a static upbringing. I'm gonna make it sound like a sap story. Don't take it like a sap story. I, because I'm always, I always feel like I uh, am the cause for a lot of things breaking, so I apologize by default. And to avoid the stereotype, no, I'm not Canadian. Man, this conversation's going a weird turn, isn't it? Um. Man. Man, that's gotta sound amazing on your end. I should say, Good job. Uh, depending upon the severity of your knowledge of English, or I'm going to assume that you have, because you can understand most of what I'm saying. I apologize again, but I'm only saying it because I know English is not an easy language to understand in any aspect, much less speak it. The example gets brought up constantly, but the sentence Buffalo, 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 stupid thing, is phonetically a, is a proper sentence in the English di uh, lexicon. English is stupid. Why did I choose this language? All oh, right, I grew up in the middle of America. But if it does make you feel any better, I have a friend who speaks Japanese and he mixes me up constantly switching to Japanese. I guess he's a translator, English to Japanese. All right. Fantastic. Sounds good. Well and done. it's much like me trying to speak Spanish. I can understand Spanish pretty well, especially if I can visibly see the person. 
so I can get visual cues on what they're trying to say. But I cannot speak Spanish back at all. So I understand the struggle to a degree. Not fully. Uh, thank you for calling me handsome. Unfortunately, I can't elaborate, but gracias is the only thing I got for you. Say, I want to keep the Espanol. That's really most of the phrases I got, other than basic, how do I not die, phrasing. How do I not die in, in, in phrases in Spanish? <sighs> Here's a combo for you. Now, if you're trying to work on your boot, this is kind of this is kind of the exercise you're looking for. I took Spanish in school, and that was, a, that was an elective, a.k.a. optional. If you are forced to take three languages in French, in uh, French, France, there we go. If you're forced to take three languages, you are miles above the average American. Forgive me if I talk myself up, but I'm a little bit above the average American in that I understand... I understand one language, can't speak it, and I only got like bits of another language. Anyway, let me work on this. I'm gonna do this wrong. get on to my next rep here. Sorry. Power just completely tanked. That might happen a couple times tonight. Just long enough to turn, take everything offline.
also, I'll fix the, uh, I'll fix the ratio over there in just a second. Great. Nice. I'm playing through my computer monitor right now, not on a separate TV. Don't worry. Okay. That's just Elgato. It's not emulation. And then we just do one of these. Nope. Uh, apparently, apparently for the females, apparently for the females, it's got like a sultry, semi-seductive voice to it, according to friends. But I don't use it. Like... From what people have told me, the closest approximation I can give you for the female ring voice is like Rouge the Bad or Camilla from Fire Emblem. Like that. <laughs> you should feel it in your stomach, it's not your arm. Again, I only have friend accounts. Friend uh, notices of this stuff. Which, by the by. Once we get out of this fight, I'll show you it, but I learned, I learned that, I learned, uh, I learned by exploring that you can change both your announcer voice and your character appearance on the uh, gear equipment screen. Anyway, let's do this and show off my, my limited shoulder thing. Also, yeah, Bates. Again, that's that whole strategy thing that I'm bad at. I have played the utter crap out of Fire Emblem Warriors. In fact, I 100% of that game, minus the uh, the S rank bonds or S rank uh, relationships. So Fire Emblem, for the most part, goes over my head. Unless you want to talk heroes or warriors, it all goes over my head. And even then I stopped playing Heroes like a year ago. Because I realized it was getting too money grubby. $10 for a season pass? And you're still stingy with the free with the freebies? Nah. You lost me. Alright, I guess ten dollars a month for a pass. Plus being stingy with your drop with your uh Free roll things, nah, miss me. Okay. Oh man, I played the crap out of it. I played the crap out of it. Like, um, I gotta rest my arms. My shoulder strength is terrible, by the way. Um, like. I bought the game and all of its DLC and I sunk in 225 plus hours into Fire Emblem Warriors. Anyway, that aside, gotcha. I am fine with gotcha if it is if it is gracious with its drop rates and how it gives you things. Like Fire Emblem and Heroes, that's a bad gotcha. It started off promising, and then power creeped super hard. Now it's a terrible gotcha. It is very blatant about it's very blatant about give me money. But on the other hand, another Nintendo-owned gotcha game, Dragalia Lost, 
I will talk up and down the block about that. Because it held, it held my attention very hard for just shy of two years. And then I... And then I kind of hit the point where I don't even care about end game stuff. So... When your end game loses the player, I, uh, yeah. Oh, man. Like, I'm a big time Dragalia Lost player. I, I'm. I can't squash end game, end game content like some people can. But I have enough where if I try for like a day and a half. I can take on, if I try it hard enough, I can do endgame content in that game. I have the power, the units, everything. Plus they are very generous, shoulders again. Plus that game is very generous with the freebies. That is a good gotcha. Uh, made by the same people who do Grand Blue. Uh, Grand Blue Fantasy. Fate, Grand Order, those games. What is what are they called? I bet you if I loaded up the, the program, I could tell you right away. Oh, a little bit. Let's see. I, it's already scrolled off screen because I lost my power. But, uh, Kuretsu, Kuretsu. Can I tease out? You can do it. Um, what you're seeing here is a everyday event. I work out for this long that you're going to see tonight. I'm going to work out for as long as you see tonight. Every other day and, ev and every day that I don't go to work. By the way, I do a physical labor, physically inclined job for my 9 to 5. So this is normal for me, it's just that my shoulder strength is butts. Like I've always been weak in the shoulders. That's the bad part. Oh, it's like my favorite thing. Not in a creepy way, of course. The one probably have presented that as such. Um, like whenever I meet somebody and greet somebody, my default reaction is a hug. Like, I look big and intimidating, I'm a softie. Is working his way out of me. Warrior. <sighs> no, that burp is from way down here. The burp of all you've had since noon is an energy is a zero calorie, zero sugar energy drink. You need to eat something. To which I'm going to tell your body, no, shut up. I'm going to go have a salad after this. <sighs> and even before that, my, my lunch was a turkey on wheat with mustard. No cheese.
Oh. Come on, babe. Okay, let's switch sides. There's also a stereotype of me and where I live. In Los Estados Unidos, but one, one of the very things I've learned, remembered how to say in Spanish, in the United States, I'm in Wisconsin. Wisconsin, as a state, is known for three things. Cows, cheese, beer. <laughs> so, a little bit of French, a little bit of German. <laughs> No, no, but I don't have a yoga stun, so it'll work. Oh. You should feel it in your stomach, not your arm. Uh, yes. Uh, not superior. Well, I'm not that close to it. I'm closer to the capital of our state. I'm like an hour north of the capital of the state. So, Wisconsin is one of the ones that has a great lake on its border, uh, Michigan, Lake Michigan specifically. But yeah, I'm in the middle of that place. Like, let me give you a summation of what the national pride is of our state. Beer cheese soup. It's beer and a spicy cheese. <laughs> That's the soup. <laughs> Maybe a little bit of the stock in there. Hey man, I don't know. Like, like, not pinpointing you and don't tell me your location if you don't feel okay, comfortable. Let's go. But, if you were to tell me, I live in Calgary. I'm assuming location. I live in Calgary, or I live, live near uh, Versailles or something like that, in France specifically. I feel, I feel like that's France. Amazing. I couldn't tell you where you are on the map. Geography is my weakest subject. Great. Done. Great hustle. Keep it up. Bear soup. That's a soup I would like to try. Okay. So I talk about this with friends all the time. I talk about this with friends all the time. But I hold a philosophy. I hold the philosophy that never turn your nose up at any food that you haven't tried once. Try everything at least once. Maybe even once a decade as well. Because there are so many foods, there are so many foods you miss out on if you just go, no, I don't like that color. No, I don't like that consistency. Okay, so you kind of... <laughs> okay, so that geographical location, roughly. Like... Uh oh, the children's, they're sad. No mama, no papa. Like, here's the thing. Keep going. You gotta try everything once. Like, and forgive me for using a stereotype on this, Curtis, but um, I know, like, 
generally a delicacy in France is frog's legs. It Does it creep me out to look at? Yes. Will I at least try it? Yes. Water up. But that's the same way I found out some of my favorite foods. Calamari, delicious. A, uh, a Reuben sandwich, which is rye bread, Thousand Island dressing, sauerkraut, and corned beef. And a little bit of cheese. Swiss cheese. That's like my favorite sandwich. Like on paper, those both sound disgusting. They are delicious. You aren't you aren't worried about the plot of this game. Also, I want to see my totals before I keep going. I really hope you aren't about, worried about the plot because I think I think the game just said, "Hey, there's a major character that you find out in like chapter four or five that's going to be re reintroduced in this chapter based on context clues." Actually, hold on. Let's move ingredients. Drink this. There we go. Double ingredients. I try him once. I would try both those foods once. Just because I am very... Seafood is the one thing where I kind of waver on. Like I said, I like calamari. I'm fine with shrimp and perch and cod, but a lot of other uh, sea seafaring life and other seafood, I'm iffy on. It, I think it mainly dates back to a bad experience I had when I was like seven, and I'm and I'm working and getting over that. something weird that I really like. To be honest, I can't think of a food. Okay. <clears throat> okay, here's a food that's weird That's weird to some people, and I don't know if they serve it in France. Have you ever had deep fried pickles? Or gherkins? I guess it's another common phrase for them. Oh, I missed one. item. Okay, it's very basic. You just take a pickle, chop it into like burger slices, throw it in some batter, deep fry it, that's it. It's super simple 
and it's delicious, but it's weird because you're so used. Because be the first time you try it, your brain is like, your brain is like, oh wait, pickles are supposed to be cold. This is hot, but it's good. Also, cheese curds. Deep fried cheese curds. That's another one. Oh, here we go again. Okay. Yeah, like, let's say if you have the ability to uh, expand your horizons and try things, in your, on your own time. See if you make some deep fried pickles. I highly recommend them. I've done too many of those in a row. I'm slowing down considerably. Workout ends between 40 in game minutes and 50 in game minutes. Or if I've reached approximately 250 calories plus burn. So I'm starting to hit my end of the day. Now the numbers on Twitch won't show it, but usually that means I'm streaming for this for about an hour and a half. <laughs> see my clock right now but I have to assume it's close to nine o'clock right now no eight o'clock eight p.m. if the background lighting doesn't give that away It's 8.30. Never mind. It's later. Thought. <laughs> Sweat. <laughs> Do not recommend. Zero out of ten.
Um, as disgusting as it might sound, some people, some people view it as disgusting. Some people view it as a sign of hard work. And I will admit, in some mediums or some forms of videography, sweat is viewed as sexy. So unfortunately, you've done nothing wrong, by the way. But unfortunately, those are not kid-friendly things. <laughs> Give me one second. Oh. That would explain a lot. No, no. You're fine. You haven't done anything wrong. It's a, it's a cultural boundary thing. I don't care. I shouldn't say cultural boundary. More like a cultural difference. You can... I don't impose many rules, okay? If that's what you're wondering at this point. I don't impose many rules. Just be chill. You can say what you want. Hell, you can even curse if you want. I avoid that, but I don't care if you curse. Just keep in mind where we are and that children can always pop in at any p given time. <laughs> Even this early in the morning for you or late at night for me. Cabbages! And corn. Hold on, there was corn. Wait, 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 hold up. Eh. I wouldn't worry yourself too much about it. Like, I myself, I myself, I will avoid saying specific words. Because I do, by the way, this is, I do re-upload all my VODs on YouTube on a stream archive channel. But, like, I myself, I've fixed my speech patterns a lot recently, but I have, I have fixed my speech patterns a lot. Uh, yeah, leg rush chance. <laughs> it's all good. Like, I fixed my speech patterns in the last few years because a lot of the platforms I put content out on has really clamped down on saying curses. Plus, I also have two nephews now. Scooter, you went in there to drink a smoothie. My god, he's gone from suck to stupid. Corn! Hit the pinwheel with an air. Yeah, doing good. Um, but yeah. I'm just getting better about my speech patterns because every platform has gone from express yourself to, hey, watch the goddamn language. Over the last year and a half, two years. You can speed up by pressing me against yourself, but... I'm going to hit myself in the back of the head a lot here. Coins better than no coins. Get the enemy's color, then select the skill. Oh. 
My science is going crazy. By the way, it has been hot as hell today. It's been hot as hell today, and it's just started raining cats and dogs, or raining a lot. So, my sinuses are all sorts of crazy. Because every set of pollen that's released in the air today, throughout being so far super hot, is now just pelting down the ground super fast. And my sinuses hate me for it. I got a yoga mat. Uh, I have a yoga mat back here, which, uh, Curtis, for future, for future ring fit endeavors, invest in a in a in a cushion mat of some kind. Or a yoga mat. Uh, here we go again. Hang on. My ring con likes to do this, or my my left joy con does this occasionally. Where you are right now, you aren't doing a lot on the floor. <clears throat> but those leg scissors basically put your elbows on the floor, and if you do that on a carpet, you will tear it up. You will also do planks on the floor, which is basically toes, which is, planks are basically toes, elbows on the floor, crunch your center upward. And depending upon how well you can see that, because I did a set without my mat on me, you can see that red mark there. That's from 30 reps of planks on carpet without a mat. It tears your arms up pretty bad. planks like world five ish somewhere in world five and then again like world 12 so if you're doing strictly the story that's when you should start watching out for planks for real it's a real good single target yellow skill but if you are not a pad of some kind it hurts your elbows more than it hurts your abs. Wonderful. All right. Like, for reference. Feels great to move your body. For reference, I started this game on difficulty 21 out of 30. And I'm currently 30 out of 30. I got planks when I was on difficulty 23, and it hurt. And it hurt like a... The wheel of fate has expanded. I see level threes. Okay. Do you see all these level threes? Look here, sire. Do you see all these level threes up here? 
crap. I gotta look at these now. I have to look at my wheel. Turn up. I can do the Shakira again. Oh, I know what I'm gunning for. Oh, right away. Right away. We're getting the level three Shakira. damage up, raw defense up, heart, raw defense up, I'm just looking at all this, raw damage up, raw heart up, raw defense up, man, the wheel of, the wheel of fate has turned, I don't think I'm anywhere near done with this game, Alright, let's go. Enough gawking, let's go. Hold. Oh! I wanna rewind. That was cheap. Woohoohoo! Moment- er, uh, physics! Oh yeah. But don't extend the pack of stones. Like Like I tell everybody doing this, please be honest with the game. Be brutally honest with the game. Nice work. Cause the last thing I need somebody to do is not exercise go into this game at level 30 and go, I got this, Sonic. And then get themselves bodied. Like, when the game says work out within your limits, it's not just trying to be nice to you. Work out within your limits. Please! Oh! Okay. They call him Tip in this game. T I P P, as in tips and tricks. Feel it in your stomach when you breathe that. I like the skill. <sighs> or I guess in this version, rather. Um. But no, like I was saying, um, but yeah, I was on elliptical every day, so I told the game when I started, I weigh 250 pounds. I exercise daily with somewhat rigorous 
uh, frequency. And it started me at level 21. Oh yeah. You know, little, little pushes will do better. Like again, that time over there, I'm crazy. Oops, wrong button. I'm almost at the end of my thing for today. Like that time limit over there, I'm crazy. So only follow my example if you're equally as crazy. But do it within this with do it within what's well within your ability. Okay, let's move. This will target your back. Like, my uh like when I say I have a physically active job. I'm, uh, I guess the best way I can describe it is I pick up and I load and push around goods in a shipping facility, a facility kind of like Amazon. I do that for eight hours a day. So, on an average day, I walk six, six to eight miles, and... Or three to five and a half, or three and a half to five kilometers, I think, is the equation. Oh Every day. Plus, I'm picking up boxes that range anywhere from two pounds to fifty pounds, all day. Or Good job. one kilogram to twenty-three kilograms. I know my rough trans, like, I know my rough translations of weight, but not perfect. Well done. Keep it up. Weight and distance, rather. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Nice. Nice work. appreciate it. It boosts my ego. <laughs> it gives me the confidence I need. All right, running. a lot, but that's fine. Man. You got me in high spirits, Curtis. If I didn't get to have to go to work tomorrow, like, real talk, if I didn't have to go to work in the morning, I would keep, you've got me feeling a way where I would have no problem streaming some more. Because you're being awesome right now. But, alas. You did it. Alas. I must go to work. In about, Doing great. I must leave for work in about 10 hours? Yeah. I have to leave for work in approximately 10 hours time. Drop your hips. So yeah. <laughs> uh. But, do know, in most occasions, I do stream more than this. Yeah, it's almost nine o'clock right now, and I need. It's almost nine o'clock right now, and I need about I need roughly an hour to cool down. 
to cool down, also I need to eat dinner. Oh, pfft. Dude, don't ruin your sleep. I appreciate it, but please don't ruin your sleep schedule for me. Sleep is super important. Like, I'm as frazzled as I'm as frazzled or as scatterbrained as I am right now because I only got six hours of sleep last night because I had to export a sound clip from a recording I did last night. And exporting in full lossless audio codec takes forever to process. So, I would have gone to bed at like 10.30 last night, but I'm going to bed at like quarter to midnight. And I had to wake up at 6. <sighs> That's great. Alright, exactly a mile, or 0.75 kilometers. Or is it 0.6? Regardless, I almost did 300 calories. I probably did more because the game has trouble tracking, and again, I am wearing a... a, uh vest that promotes sweating. Man, look at all that. Alright, stretch it out. Let's begin our static stretching. You won't need the ring con. Be mindful of your body and stretch within the range of your ability. Spread your feet, raise both hands. Music studies, hell yeah. Wrist. You know, I've got a friend. While pulling on your wrist, I make it sound like I'm talking a big game, but I'm being real. I have a friend, um, goes by the name of Resonant Hearts on most platforms, also known as Platinum Rhythm. Original position, switch hands, and bend the other way. Like, I've told him up front before, so he knows this is how I feel about him. But, like, he, is, he has completed his music Don't studies. He is a fantastic musician, has a beautiful singing voice, but doesn't believe any of that. So, when you say you're doing music studies, I know the struggle and all that. Raise both arms and pull down on your left but I also know that stretch your upper arms my musical prowess is down. nowhere near as good as you or my friends. Like, I can play almost any instrument on the bass clef, but you get me in that treble clef, I have issues. Now do the same on the opposite side. My vocal range is bass to low tenor. Slowly. I play the trombone, uh, baritone, and tuba. And I'm pretty sure if you gave me an hour, I could figure out a bass guitar. Anything else? Not happening. Bring yourself back slowly. Put your right foot forward and cross your legs. Bend your body forward and stretch the back of your left leg. Hold it like that for a little longer. Straighten up. Switch legs. I also like finding random songs to sing, even if I don't Start know the language. Your fingertips close to your back leg. Like, do I still remember the lyrics to that song? Um, I don't remember them all. As you hold. Slowly straighten up, bit by bit. Oh, okay. I, I'm, I'm following. It's clicking. Put your right leg forward. So you just want to know the effects of music. Bend on the right brain and stretch out your left calf like I know I want to say the one song that I know of recently that doesn't cause me to rattle my voice with going legs. with because the notes go too high is oddly enough a uh, Bink Sake from One Piece and stretch out but I've forgotten most of the lyrics in Japanese and I don't even know lyrics in English so it's just Rotate your hands behind your back and grasp your left wrist. While pulling your wrist to the right, lower your yo, hips the same way. Yo, well, I'm doing it wrong. Yo, yo. Bring your neck back Funny up thing is, I don't watch One Piece. The opposite direction as well. Stretch slowly. Don't overdo it. <laughs> I don't hate the show, I just don't have time to watch anime. And especially now the fact that One Piece is like 900 plus episodes long. Bring yourself back slowly. And your stretching is complete. Good job. Did it. Exercised it, or stretched it out. Work it out, work it out, make it happen. Oh, 
Other funny thing, by the way, Curtis. Yeah, you're at the same. You don't remember. The, you're at the same part where I am with the lyrics. <laughs> um. So other funny thing, Curtis. Even though I haven't done it for like six months now, is casually I speed run Sonic R. I don't do it very often, and it's not a long game. It's like 18 minutes. Like Sonic runs, Sonic R speed runs are 18 to 20 minutes long, so it's not a long game. <laughs> but that's like the other key thing about me that like I'm kind of known for on Twitch and and YouTube and extent is, I. I have an unfortunate addiction to Sonic R and Sonic in general. <sighs> okay. Anyway, all of that's said and done. I don't. I'm not famous, man. I just been. I just been doing this for far too long. With everything said and done, is there any questions uh, anybody would like to ask? Here was cute. Who? Who's who was cute? <laughs> so they quite this. No, 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 no. <laughs> you! Okay. Whew. Okay. Enough playful banter. It's 9 o'clock, and I do need to finish up. So, as I always do, Curtis, because I think you're... Uh, this, this is more against me and not against you. It is late, and I know you're probably going to go to sleep as soon as I'm done here. But at the end of my streams, I let... The viewers choose where we raid for the night. So I'll give you a list of people that are on the docket, and we'll go from there. Probably clear up some things. Alright, what do we got? So, these are people that I follow. You guys can choose... You guys can choose where the raid goes. If you have no preference, I let auto hosts take over from there. Because I know it's late, and not a lot of people will be streaming much later than I am right now. So, let me actually get up to the microphone so I don't have to yell this. So, the choices I have for you this evening are... Alternic24. He's playing some Mario Party 2. Looks, it looks like he's playing with friends, doing kind of a donation drive because he's having a little bit of trouble with money at the moment. Not, not saying donate to the man. If you can't do it, don't. He, that's, that's his model too. But that's what, we, that's what he's got going on. Uh, Naka Talili is streaming uh, Dragon Quest Builders 2, making Midden, Middenhall Castle. Basically rebuilding Middenhall from the ground up in-game. Uh, Maryland is playing Monster Sanctuary. Kind of a, kind of a tactics Pokemon kind of game, from what I remember seeing. Uh, Botanic Sage is playing Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. Uh. Kaioken, Kenny is playing Overwatch, and I think it's King Blaze, but he's on Sarge's channel. King Blaze is playing Breath of the Wild. So I'll run through the list again. Alternate 24, Mario Party 2. Nakatilili, Dragon Quest Builders 2. Maryland, Monster Sanctuary. Botanic Sage, Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, the remake. Kaioken, Overwatch, uh, King Blaze. Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Holy cow, it's a mouthful. Do you have any preferences, or should I just kind of let auto host take over? And I'll wait a minute while it happens. Um, uh, 
Okay, so I'll throw you over to Dominic. Uh, Alternic24, Dominic is his, other, is, his, is his actual name, and he answers to Dominic more frequently. I don't have a raid message to give you. You can just say hi. Uh, I will give you a fair warning, though. Whereas I, I don't shy away from the crude stuff, he is, as Americans will say, a, a goon. Or crass is probably the best way I can describe it. Anyway. Let's throw it over to him. Thank you for coming out. Uh, keep an eye on Twitter. I don't know if I'll be streaming on Saturday or not, because I have planned Saturday. But if I do stream Saturday, it'll probably be my normal ring fit session, followed by something else, because Saturday is when I get a chance to stream for longer. And all my links to my other stuff are down below the video player. Anyway. Have a good evening, Curtis. I appreciate you staying up to come out tonight. And please, don't ruin your sleep schedule for me. Please. Alright. Have a good evening.